because some fresh food is getting more expensive, you don't have to compromise on making healthy choices. Everyday staples, for the most part, remain low cost. And here's something even better about them. They're also secret superfoods. Here to tell us all about it is Weekend Sunrise nutritionist Sarah DiLorenzo. Morning to you, Sarah. OK, you're starting with carbs first. What are the best choices? OK, so oats are definitely a fantastic choice. One kilo of oats can be $1.65 and it can give you 22 servings of oats. So it's wonderful for lowering our cholesterol, cholesterol and really good also for feeding the good bacteria in our gut. I've done an overnight oat there, which is basically where I've just soaked some oats in some yogurt, also some milk. I've got some cinnamon in there. You stir that together and you put that in the fridge the night before and there you have something that's really easy and really versatile to grab on the go in the morning. And other great things we can do with oats is we can put them in savoury dishes as well as sweet dishes too. Also for carbs in there, what, um, I've got potatoes. So potatoes can be like $3.80 for a bag a kilo of white potatoes and $4.50 for sweet potato. They're a great source of vitamin A, vitamin C, potassium, fibre, a huge staple in my household. I've done something different there where I put a sweet potato in the oven for 45 minutes and I've got some breakfast ingredients in there, some scrambled eggs, some salsa, Yum. and that's just a great way of enjoying some sweet potato. That is delicious. And yeah. that overnight oats, which I use your recipe yeah. all the time, it's such, so delicious, such a great way to start the day. Fruit and veg. Okay, so bananas, like $3 for a kilo of bananas, which is around seven, so around seven bananas. And what I've done there is I've done Yum. same as the potato, is I put the banana in the oven for 15 minutes, taken it out, cut it in half, and I've got cinnamon, I've got some um, peanut butter on there, as well as some yogurt and some chocolate shards. But also, don't go past frozen vegetables. For They start from about $2.80. I've done a little bit of a, a Thai sort of twist on that with some peanuts, and I've got some lime in there, some sesame oil, snap frozen, harvested when they're ripe. So they're retaining all of their nutrients. Yeah, such a good reminder. And now protein. Okay, so eggs. Eggs are fantastic. So anywhere from $2 to $8 from a cage egg to an organic egg. B vitamins, they've got the biotin, which is great for hair, skin and nails. Wonderful source of protein too. And so I always encourage people to look at them for things like not just the boiled egg for a snack, you can enjoy them also for you know frittatas and quiches and as well for protein too, sardines. So that tin of sardines there was 85 cents and I got almost 400 grams of, of fresh sardines. I got that for just around $3.33. Sardines are actually called sardines because they're in abundance in Sardinia. I've just married those two together and I have made sardines and egg on toast with avocado Yum. with some pickles on top. A little bit Northern European. Delicious and a great way to enjoy sardines. Oh, delicious. Legumes? Okay, so legumes so cheap, so affordable, nutrient dense, good source of fibre, lowering cholesterol, lowering blood pressure. I've made what I've called my legume stew and I've got in here chickpeas, tomatoes, stock, lentils, beans, chilli flakes, dried oregano. I put it together on the stove to the boil and then let it simmer for 40 minutes. Wonderful way to really enjoy legumes oh. and bring them into the diet. And that's like a $4 meal there. That so is it's amazing. Really Does it count as a vegetable? Um, no, no, like, okay, you know, they're, they're a mixture of a carbohydrate and a protein. Okay, mm. all right. And finally, you know, what my for sweet tooth is like. <laughs> okay, so, so, yeah, so for something sweet, why not try just doing popcorn from yourself? I've actually done that with, and popcorn's that whole grain. It's a kernel that also has is linked to lowering blood pressure, also linked to lowering cholesterol too. With the popcorn there, I've actually just done it with some cinnamon, which is wonderful for the ageing brain. I've got in there some honey as well as some um, olive oil. Cook that off really easily and as for peanut butter, fantastic. Um, I've made a peanut butter biscuit there where I've just got some peanut butter. I've also put some honey, two eggs in there, and I've just blended that together and made a really simple and very easy biscuit. Peanut butter is fantastic, and research shows that people who, who enjoy it have long-term health and wellness. So there we have it, some Saturday oh, morning amazing. recipe, inspiration, superfoods that are super cheap. A veritable tsunami of superfoods. Sarah, it looks so good and we're both obsessed <laughs> with peanut butter. Thank you, Sarah. I know, that's our obsession. As always, Thank you. yum. Thank you.